Well, hello, my mystic friends. This is your mystic card reader, Ben, with a weekly reading for February 13th through February 19th. So I'm going to start some weekly readings here on my channel and see how they are received and if it's something that I want to do. So I'm going to try it out for a couple of weeks. I'm using the Archangel Power Tarot cards by Doreen Virtue and Radley Valentine. I'll be pulling a card for Monday and Tuesday, a card for Wednesday and Thursday, and a card for Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. I pray here that the spirit gods and archangels bring me messages to myself and those few that see this video for this upcoming week. May you bring us messages of guidance, direction, insight, and love. Whoa. Okay, I guess those are those cards. So we have the Chariot card with Archangel Metatron for Monday and Tuesday. Wednesday and Thursday we have the Queen of Gabriel, passionate, charming, brilliant, and independent. And then the weekend, Friday through Sunday, we have the Epiphany card. For Monday and Tuesday we have determination and self-control, career advancement, acknowledgement of success by others. The Chariot is an indicator of great determination and willpower. You may feel uncertain regarding your situation, but you have no need to fear. When this card is present, it's your confirmation from Archangel Metatron that you have what it takes. Step out of your comfort zone this Monday and Tuesday and charge bravely ahead with joy and confidence. A great leap forward is coming your way. It will take balance, self-control, and hard work, but you're ready for the task at hand. Public recognition for your success is sure to come. Allow yourself to feel pride in what you accomplish. So at the beginning of the week here, I know everybody don't like Mondays and Tuesdays, but go ahead and feel good about yourself that you're starting out your week. You finished one week and you're starting another one. Take pride in what you're doing. Learn to balance your tasks, projects, and responsibilities, and just have fun. Be determined and have self-control and acknowledge your success. And who knows, you may have an acknowledgement of your success by others. If not, go ahead and acknowledge yourself. Congratulations. You're doing a great job and you're right where you need to be. Here for Wednesday and Thursday, we have the Queen of Gabriel. Again, this is for passionate, charming, brilliant, independent. It says you can do anything right now. Go after what you want. The ability to attract helpful people. You can do anything right now. So here in the middle of the week on Wednesday and Thursdays, know that you can do anything you set your mind to. You may not fully grasp how wonderful you are, but those around you definitely see it. And we go back to this card, Acknowledgement of Success by Others. So we have a continuation theme throughout the beginning of the week and the middle of the week of being successful and being, you know, nodded on the shoulder and patted on the back by others and those around you. So rest assured that others will see your hard work and be there for you. Your kind eagerness to help others in their lives will also attract people willing to do the same for you. An additional meaning for this card also says following through on an advice that you receive. So people are going to be able to there to acknowledge your success and be there to give you what you need, but also allow yourself to receive that guidance and insight and input that others may have for you this week. And go after for what you want this week, especially the middle of the week here on Wednesday and Thursday. And finally for the weekend, we have the Epiphany card. It says joy through spiritual growth. Be a light to others and answers that come through meditation. So here at the beginning of the week, we have um, success in going through your week with other people acknowledging you and acknowledging your success. And then here at the week, you're doing the same for others. So you're being a light to others and you're acknowledging others for their success and their good works here at the end of the week. The Epiphany card tells us that you're on a quest to discover your true self. Meditation and quiet time provide great insight into the nature of your own heart and your life and purpose. This is not a time of loneliness, but an inner joy and exploration of your divine light within you is at hand. 
You may find a mentor who magically shows up at the right moment, and it comes at a time for you to share your own spiritual growth with others who are seeking a mentor. So you have a mentor showing up for you, and you're also being a mentor to others. So look for ways to help others, especially this weekend, this Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Additional meanings for this card includes consider life's mysteries and spend some quiet time alone. Be a light unto others and heed your own counsel. Wide advice is coming your way. Look at the ladybug who just landed on my arm. Awesome. Very cool sign. Hey, Miss Ladybug. Hey, Miss Ladybug. I'm just going to leave that bug there at the moment. And I'm going to go ahead and pull one card for from Notes from the Universe on Abundance for an overall message this week that you need to meditate on and just have, you know, a good understanding of. Very beautiful card. You have a mountain which looks like a sunset and a meadow and a, a beautiful rainbow there in the background. And this card says, Behold, a new day with rainbows, sunshine, and blue skies. New players, rebounds, and recoveries. Abundance, health, and harmony. Just like you've been picturing them, right? Right? Please tell me you've been picturing them. It takes so little, the universe. So this card is reminding us to um, go ahead and picture abundance, health, and harmony in our lives. And every day is a brand new day. Go ahead and picture abundance, health, and harmony. And it will come to pass. It starts with believing it in your heart and seeing it in your mind's eye. And it takes so little as the universe reminds us. So awesome. I thank you for your time and I hope that you got something out of it and something to take with you throughout this week. And remember, you can visit my website at www.mysticcardreader.com to get one of your first readings for free. Go ahead and click on book a free reading and schedule a reading with me. I'll be glad to do a video reading. Now video readings are anonymous and password protected, so only you will see this video. So again, thanks for watching, and until next time, be blessed. Much love, joy, happiness, and success being sent to you now and always. Don't forget to open up your mind's eye and see the bigger picture. Take care, guys, and have a wonderful, blessed week.